Hi guys, this is Josh. Today I've got a great little web app to show you that's called Webkimi. You may have seen me using this on my Google Plus page or Facebook. I've posted several little sketches and drawings that I've I've made using Webkimi. And uh, it, it is a uh, web application that runs in a web browser like Chrome, and which means that it is uh, truly cross-platform. You can run this on Mac, Linux, PC, Android, your phone, a tablet, anything that has a web browser, you can run WebKimi. And it's a very unique and very powerful little sketching drawing app. It's different than maybe you might be uh, used to seeing sort of these pixel-based drawing applications where you're using brush strokes and creating lines. This is more um, for those who come from a vector graphic background or vector illustration background. I think that you'll be a little bit uh, more familiar, maybe pick up this, 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 the whole idea of this a little bit quicker. Basically, by, by the, the features that are enabled by default, um, what you have is you're drawing in filled in shapes. So if I just start by clicking around on my canvas here, uh, horizontal mirroring is enabled. And so you can see that I can quickly start creating designs and patterns just by drawing out these shapes. And it's really interesting, unique. And uh, for me, it provides a lot of little inspirational visuals. And uh, I can use these um, and, and refine them further in um, uh, vector applications because you can download these as an SVG, Scalable Vector Graphic. You can also download it as a PNG, an image file. And you've got lots and lots of options in here. And it's just fantastic for coming up with sort of random, randomized, uh, just interesting um, visual patterns and, and uh, designs. You can see here you can really do some interesting stuff and, and quickly get something that you probably wouldn't if you were sitting down with a, a traditional pen and paper or even in Photoshop. Um, so I really enjoy using this and I've been using it a lot. And actually I've used it also not just for illustration or inspiration, but for logo design, believe it or not. Being able to create something that's perfectly symmetrical um, is very helpful. And my favorite way to use this so far is with my Samsung Galaxy Note 4. And because it's a web app, I can run this on my Galaxy Note 4 just like I, I could in a web browser on my Mac or PC. So let me show you. I'll just share my screen with you here. What this looks like on my phone, because this is how I normally use it. So here we're looking at my my phone screen and um, uh, so with the with the, the little stylus that comes with the Galaxy Note 4, like I said, this is my favorite way to to use this little app. And I can just start sketching out little little ideas, and I've got a lot of control with this little pen. And uh, I can get really intricate. You can pinch and zoom in, zoom out, and you have all the same features. I can download this to my phone as an SVG, which then I could just send to my email address or uh, sync to my computer if I want to. Or I could download the PNG and share it on Facebook or Instagram or Google+. Uh, but you can see how you can, you can really just, just by, just by sketching and being creative and, and really not thinking too hard about it, you can create some really fun, unique, interesting little um, ornamental pieces, tidbits that, you know, I could then use in other applications. Now, I do want to note that when you download this as an SVG, if you open this in, say, Illustrator, Inkscape, um, Corel Draw, iDraw, uh, Affinity Designer, any of these vector-based applications, these most likely will be um, not closed paths. Um, and so just, just uh, as, as a sort of best practices, um, you'd want to just select everything and then close all the paths. 
that will make sure that all of these shapes are actually closed shapes. Otherwise, you're going to see like all these shapes as just outlines, or they won't have a fill color, so you won't see anything. Anyway, it's a lot of fun, as you can see, and I love playing around this, playing around with this on my phone. I can just hit this uh, page button and hit clear and start a new uh, drawing. You can get really detailed and uh, and actually use uh, shapes to create line work. For example, I've I've uh, I've been drawing a lot of dwarves, and so you can you can see here how you know, I can start sort of drawing in a face here. Give him a big nose. Big old mustache, beard. And you can hit this, hit un undo if you mess up by chance. I can zoom in here. And y yes, it does look pixelated when you zoom in like this, but rest assured, when you save this as an SVG, this is all solid, crystal clear vector information. I believe that it just does this uh, sort of low quality rendering to make it fast. And it is very, very fast, very responsive. So you can see how detailed you can get here. This is a great app for, um, I think, uh, uh, tattoo design. Um, like I said, illustration, something like this. And you can see I can just focus on one side of the face. And I know that it's mirroring on the other side perfectly symmetrically, which is nice with that horizontal mirroring option. So I, I like to just be loose and fluid and have fun and play with this little guy. Web Committee. It's a lot of fun. You should check it out. I'm going to keep playing. Go check out Web Committee. It works on your Mac, PC, Linux. Android device, your phone, anything with a web browser, give it a go. Uh, let me see what you make. Thanks, guys. I'll see you later.